the young filly situation has taken a dramatic turn with new information surfacing. From the alleged victim's statements to Chunks breaking his silence and now Philly himself appearing to speak out about the allegations, everyone is wondering what will happen next. Make sure to watch until the end for all the details. Just two days ago, the internet was ready to lock up young Philly for life, with many people believing he was guilty and that he had already lost the battle of public opinion. However, today the tide has turned in his favour and now people are calling for his release. But why the sudden shift? For those who missed our earlier videos, let's quickly recap the situation and explain what has changed. Cut. When the news about young Philly's arrest first broke, the serious nature of the allegations left many fans in shock. There were posts saying things like, Not victim blaming, but young women need to be careful. Don't go to hotel rooms with men you don't know. He could be a bad person, but some of these girls go to hotel rooms and later claim victimhood, sometimes for money. We shouldn't judge right away. Others added that people are too quick to judge without knowing the full story. One fan wrote, We don't know what happened, but don't crucify him without finding out more. It could happen to anyone. Someone could pretend to enjoy something, then accuse you later and ruin your life with false claims. The young Philly case is unusual because, in most cases, people tend to blame the victim and support the celebrity, but this time the reaction was the opposite. Everyone quickly assumed Philly was guilty. Recently, a viral video on TikTok and X, formerly Twitter, featured an Australian woman claiming that the woman suing young Philly, Emma Burns, is a known worker in that industry. She even texted her friends to cancel the Uber on the night of the incident, saying she and Philly were having a good time. Cut. Keep in mind that it's the state prosecuting young Philly and they wouldn't move forward without enough evidence. So take that video for what it is. The fact that young Philly has to wait until December 19th shows just how serious this case is. If he's found guilty, they will likely make an example out of him. A few days ago, one of Young Philly's closest friends, Chunks, spoke up about the allegations. He said he can't comment on anything since it's still an ongoing investigation. I'm not sure what people expected Chunks to say. Imagine one of your closest friends facing serious charges in another country, especially when you have business ties with them. Chunks and Young Philly were likely together most of the week, filming their podcast and doing foot asylum shoots. Then, waking up to this news must have been heartbreaking. Chunks looks like he's really going through it, but he can't be blamed for the decisions of another grown man. Whatever happens, you know Chunks will do the right thing. The most damaging part of this situation is the CCTV footage showing the alleged victim's injuries, which could be key evidence. This might be why they were able to extradite Philly from Melbourne back to Perth, where the incident supposedly happened. Just a few days ago, he was spotted avoiding reporters, wearing a baseball cap and hoodie. He quickly ran into a building, stayed for less than five minutes and left without speaking to the press. Before we dive deeper into this video, what do you think about the situation? Do you think young Philly will end up with a lengthy prison sentence or could he clear his name in December? Let us know in the comments. Following his arrest, several companies dropped him, including ASOS, Heinz, Foot Asylum and the FA. Even if young Philly is found innocent, his reputation might be permanently damaged. Being linked to something this serious can ruin how people see you. All we can hope for now is that the truth comes out, whether that means Philly going to jail if he's guilty or walking away if he's innocent. The next few months will reveal how it all unfolds. We'll keep you updated with any new information. That's it for today's video. Make sure to